Hi, this is Todd Reed, National Market Manager with Graybar, and I'm here today to speak with manufacturers about products or services that can help the contractor be more efficient, safe, and productive, and possibly open up new market opportunities so you can write new business. So as a contractor is well aware, Caddy Fasteners is known for their new products innovation, all with the intent of really trying to save uh, time in the field. Uh, less ladder time, uh, be more efficient, do more things on the ground, and, and uh, speed up installation. So a good example is that one of our new products, it's uh, an alternative to strut. So typically as a contractor, uh, you're buying 10 foot lengths, it comes out to the job or to the, to the job shop. Somebody's got to cut it to a certain length, uh, probably deburr it just to make sure it's safe, and then they got to get it out to the job site, different parts of the job site. So here's what Caddy's offered uh, or put into place. It's a 2013 ECM product of the year chosen by the contractors nationally. It's a strut channel alternative. So it's a range taking for applications from 12 to 18 inches. It already has the hardware on there, so there's no need to look for 3 8 nuts. And you simply screw that into place whatever, whenever you've determined that distance that you need. And you can put up to two, uh, two inch pipes, four two inch pipes for a 200 pound load rating and there's a safety factor there. Another application is taking basket tray and simply putting that on and then taking our bat wings that we've adapted for this application and for strut and simply pinching that into place so it's a toolless installation. So another new product of the year by ECM uh, in 2013 is the Caddy all-in-one box system. Now the challenge has been for the contractor is to take a mud ring, a box, and a box bracket, whether it's right to the stud or between the stud, and assembling it, whether he does it in a prefab shop or on site there or as each uh, box is being installed. Here's the opportunity. Uh, most contractors, once they install this onto the stud, uh, what happens is the sheet rockers will come along and they'll, they'll mangle the side and there's some wobble and the inspector doesn't want to have that box moving, so he wants it rock solid. So we can add other items to it, so Caddy has some options there, but better yet, we have, uh, have the first Caddy fastener box that's all in one. So with a puddle of metal, we've stamped this, we've stamped a box and a mud ring and a hanger system all in one, then we add a removable back plate. And if you notice this leg uh, that's on there, that acts as the far side support makes it so it's rock solid, this cannot get uh, buried by the sheet rocker. So as it's installed, even on the, the open side of the stud, it still hits the, uh, the back side of the, the metal stud. So it's rock solid, and the variations to it, it can come without the mud ring as well, mounts on all four sides, still has that removable back plate and that rock solid fire side support, can come with or without a ground wire, and then for going in between the studs, we have a 16 to 24 inch range taking solution. And uh, they can locate it where they want, take the screws out, screw it right down, and they're good to go. And some contractors like to have a kick-in style. So it's pre-measured already at the 18 inches, which is ADA compliant. They can relocate it where they want, infinite locations. But this is also a rock solid support that we've added to the all-in-one solutions. So Caddy is expanding its line of rooftop uh, solutions. Caddy Pyramid's been on the market for a few years. We started off with our first foam block and then we expanded it to include uh, thermoplastic, which is what this is, and uh, EPDM rubber. But uh, this new solution is half the size of what we've had before. Uh, which is good for a lot of applications where there's a single pipe run. A lot of times uh, the contractor goes out and buys wood and then he's got to get a piece of foam and then he's got to buy a piece of strut or strapping. So that's where we've come up with a, uh, a lower load rating. Uh, I think this is still up to about 500 pounds. They can put their pipe on there, a single pipe, use a strut strap. Uh, but the key feature is this layer of foam. So it eliminates the need for the contractor to pick up a slip sheet and put it like he's used to doing under a uh, wood block and to protect that roof membrane. There's other products on the market that are good, they're engineered solutions, but for today's roofs that have a soft membrane uh, roof as opposed to maybe gravel or other things, this is really uh, today's product that you want to use. We also have the EPDM rubber as well as the, uh, the foam and the other thermoplastic products. Encourage you to look at that, the Caddy Pyramid Rooftop Solutions.
Caddy has introduced what's called rod lock technology for 3 8 threaded rod and, and other sizes. And we've uh, updated our line to include a, a new beam clamp. And what's typically done, obviously, in the field, as you know, is the threaded rod needs to be cut, has to be deburred, and then somebody will start that and get it going, get it going, get it going. Well, the new Caddy rod lock does not require a straight cut, deburring. They can cut it at any angle and simply push it into place where they want, back it up or back it down, get fine tuning, and they're done. It's got a 500 pound load rating. They can simply finger tighten that to prevent any more bump up. And if they want to go up a little higher, they can do that or simply spin it and they're done. Rod lock is also included in an anchor, concrete anchor. So you can simply drill a pilot hole, drive the concrete anchor in, push in the rod, and you've got a 2,000 pound load rating. We recommend 660 pounds with a safety factor, but you can still back that out. And then we've included a strut nut. So that is a one piece assembly that simply uh, locks into place and you can push in your threaded rod and you have a 750 pound load rating that, that easy. You can still back out. And to make sure they don't go too far or your installer doesn't go too far, you can preload a slip-on nut, have it leveled where you want, and then simply take the assembly, go right up to it, and lock it down. So much quicker and easier, and again, it's a whole new way of planning a job so they can do more assemblies, the installers can do more assemblies on the ground, and simply uh, pop things into place.